Pine Bluff Arsenal was established in 1941, and today it remains the only operational arsenal for the production of smoke ammunition and chemical and biological defense equipment. Of the 135 items produced at Pine Bluff, two-thirds are exclusive to the arsenal because of environmental permits required and because of liabilities associated with the production of those items. With less than 1,000 personnel, the Pine Bluff Arsenal is a very high value to national defense, making products that save lives and protect soldiers. We produce white phosphorus, which Pine Bluff Arsenal has the only white phosphorus filling plant in North America. We also produce red phosphorus munitions, smoke and incendiary, and also less than lethal. Our production lot numbers start with a PB, and that stands for Pine Bluff, but it means a lot more to us that produce these products. It, it means it's a quality product, and it means I'm signing my name, and the men and women on the production line are signing their names that this product is the best product that can be built. And each and every day that we come into this arsenal, the men and women in uniform deserve our very best, and that's what they're getting from us. We make an M40 mask, which is what you see most of the servicemen with. The Army is our primary customer, but we do provide masks for the Marines, Navy, Air Force. And then we also have what's called the hard to fit mask, which is an M45 mask. We make them from scratch and we also rebuild them. The testing equipment is set up so that we can ensure that every mask that goes out is of good quality. So we're triple checking our work, making sure that what goes out is going to be able to protect the warfighter. A testing machine called an M14 simulates a mask being on a soldier's face and his face moving. If there's a pinhole, you can't necessarily see it, but that testing machine will pick it up. We take old equipment, we turn it into basically like new equipment. We have the CP DEP meds, which is the chemical protected medical deployable facility. The CBPS, which is a chemical biological protected shelter, which is more mobile, smaller, easier to get in and get out than the larger hospital unit. We repair the units that come back from overseas. They will come in in pretty bad shape, some of them in real bad shape. We'd replace engine, replace the tent that goes on the back, check the expiration date on everything. And so we bring them in, we repair them, we do everything they, that needs to be done to them, then we send them back out. We also have three different versions of a decontamination unit, which is similar to a pressure washer designed for remote decontamination of equipment and personnel. We also process uh, smoke grenade launchers that are mounted on different types of soldier equipment, Humvees, tanks. From producing conventional ammunition to repairing and rebuilding decontamination equipment and restoring mobile medical systems, the Pine Bluff Arsenal continues a legacy of quality performance in service of our national defense. It is America's arsenal. <laughs>